Chaitanya Mahaprabhu has said that this Krishna Sankirtan, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, Param Vijayate, all glories. Parang Vijayate Sri Krishna Sankirtana Anandam Vardhanam because the Sri Krishna Sankirtan will increase the ocean of transcendental bliss. <coughs> now here in this meeting we are present and an old man at seventy-four years old, and here is a child, one year old. So beginning from this child, avala vridha vanita, uh, the Sanskrit word, beginning from the child, woman, up to the old man, everyone can take part in this Sankirtan moment. Actually, we can see practically that everyone can take part in it. This is such a nice yoga system. Uh, there is no need of any material qualification. But we don't neglect material qualification. We can adopt a material qualification to uh, render service to Krishna and uh, that will make our all material position assets successful. He is trying to yes. he's, <laughs> he's seeing mothers, you see. Therefore such child they are all fortunate child, you see. He is learning automatically how to chant, how to keep the beads. Sichanang Simadangi Yoga Brasa Sanjayat. It is very nice that he have got tendency for Krishna consciousness and this is the duty of father and mother to <coughs> Uh, raise children in that Krishna consciousness so that uh, this child can be saved from further bondage of birth and death. Bhagavad says that one should not become father, one should not become mother unless they are able to save the child from the impending mouth of death. And Haring Vinana Mrtinkaran. Without Krishna consciousness, nobody can be saved from the cycle of birth and death. That is not true. There are many Vedic persons. <coughs> Javanna priti mai vasudeve <coughs> namuchyate deha yogi natav. Deha yog means contacting this material body. We are not this material body, but we have contact. Just like we contact some infectious disease, similarly, we have some or other contact. Deha yogi and that is the cause of all our misery. So Bhagavā says, javanna prīti mai vāsudeva. So long one does not develop this Krishna consciousness. There is no chance of getting out of this contact of material body. We can get very nice body or very bad body, that doesn't matter. We can get a dog's body, or we can get a demigod's body. We can live for five minutes 
there are many insects and germs which live for five minutes and there are living entities in Brahma Loka who live for five millions of years. All varieties of life there are within this universe. Huh? By Krishna's creation, you'll find anoranhi anga mahato mahya. The bigger than the biggest and the smaller than the smallest, you'll find. Uh, you see in this uh, new Vrindavan, there are big trees also, small berries in Sikhism, so small tree that you are trampling over it. So, in the living condition, there are so many varieties, eight million, four hundred thousand species. But the problem is not to promote ourselves from this small body to big body, from the ant's body to elephant's body. That is not our problem. Not to accept this material body, to have our spiritual body, Satchidānanda Vigra. Just like Krishna has Satchidānanda Vigra, Narayana has got Satchidānanda Vigra. So that is our problem. So this Krishna consciousness will give us that opportunity. And those who are grihasthas, family men, their duty is to raise their children to this Krishna consciousness so that actually the child will have full advantage of having a nice parent, nice father and mother. So this new Vrindavan we have selected to grow a community of such nice father and mother. There is sannyasi, also brahmachari, grihastha, we have no such distinction. Jai Krishna bhaje, huh? huh? Say Guru Hall. Anyone who is in Krishna consciousness and, and full in the understanding of science of Krishna, he can become a spiritual master, a teacher. So in this Vrindavan, new Vrindavan, we should live in such a way, ideal way, that people will learn that what is actually human life, what is human civilization? Uh, how? What is it is meant for? Uh, so that we have to teach to the world. So those who are conducting this institution, my request is that you develop this place in such a nice way. And you can practically see, if you train, that this child is dancing, this child is trying to chant Hare Krishna with beads. Simply they are to be instructors. They must have the association. <coughs> then there will be a new growth of population, not like cats and dogs, but actually demigods, devata. <coughs> demigods means devotees of Krishna. That's all. And Osur means non devotee. So there is enough population of Osura in this world. And the people are not happy because Asuric Bhavamasta, this demonic civilization, is killing the human race. So it is the responsibility of the members of the Krishna consciousness. <clears throat> to save so many ignorant, innocent people. They have got this human form of life to end all miserable condition of material existence. They are being misguided, simply just like animals. It is not a good civilization. So this place is out of contact. It is, it is very, it is Krishna's desert 
that here no I mean a, a man of ordinary interest will come here. It is in a very nice uh, location. Uh, it is beyond the reach of the ordinary class. <laughs> Just like Howard's father says, that I'll never come. <laughs> 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 so, Rishikesh's lawyer, he just walks up here two yeah. miles looking for his dog. Oh, his dog lost? Yes. And he's, he's all upset. Oh. Say, <laughs> <laughs> so it is Krishna's grace. Yes. <laughs> 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 he had some affection for the dog. Now he can turn his affection for Krishna. Eh? The dog is lost. <laughs> no, dog will not be lost. No, that's he will reach. The dog, they are very... They will smell and find out the way. Dog will never be lost. <coughs> so our Mr. D.D. is in samadhi. Let him take rest. You can take rest. Go. <laughs> yes. You are feeling samadhi, <laughs> Mr. Ekendra? <laughs> now you can go and take rest. Yes, you are very good. Uh, so, so these ch- children, they are coming. I especially uh, request Swami Kittarananda to take care of them. And here is a nice uh, motherly girl, uh, Sattva and her husband, they are all. So take care of these children. If you can make one child Krishna conscious, it will get a great service. Krishna will be very pleased. So so many children will come. This place is nice, and Krishna will give us all opportunity. So <clears throat> I will also come again. And I like this place, so and because I have come to a preaching world, so let me finish whatever little work is still remaining. I want to go once to London and Germany, then I will entrust the whole thing to you. <coughs> so uh, let us uh, cooperate in this movement very nicely. And here in this uh, spot, New Vrindavan, the woman's business will be to take care of the children, cooking, cleansing, and churning butter. <laughs> and those who have got the knowledge of typing, can help in time. No other hard work. That's all. This is for women. And for men, hard work, field work, taking care of the cows, of the animals, to go, to collect wood, to construct, building. In this way, cooperate. The girls who are here, they should prepare nice prasadam so that the buyers in time, they can get their prasadam timely. This is the duty. And <clears throat> they must be given a timely breakfast, lunch, prasadam. They will work hard. And the churning business is for the girls. <laughs> that will keep your health very nice. Mahajasada, uh, uh, the mother of Krishna, and just see how exalted she was. She was materially, she was rich also. She had many maid servants. Still, she took pleasure in charming. You have seen the picture. Recently in Los Angeles, uh, they had the festival, Dadi uh, what is it called? <coughs> butter, butter ceremony. So people took part in churning, and there were twelve pounds of butter churn in the meeting. Yes, and they collected good amount by churning. <laughs> <laughs> so 
how our Krishna consciousness movement is very nice. We churn butter and have festival and, and I live nicely and dance Hare Krishna. It is very nice life. So just cooperate and try to improve. It will improve if you be sincere. Krishna will send all help and someday it will be actually replica of that Vrindavan. And, <laughs> and our Kirtananda Swami, he was in a Vrindavan, he has got the ideas. Uh, here is Kesi Ghat also. And, and try cooperatively, you can do. Krishna will help. So, and Jack and he will he have decided to remain here. Very nice. Uh, you have got very nice child. Uh, now uh, Mr. Rekendra is feeling samadhi. He cannot stay. <laughs> yeah, let him take rest. You take rest. Rekendra, you take rest. Go. He, he's... He says he wants to stay. Uh, no, you are feeling samadhi. <laughs> Take rest. Yes, that will be nice. Then I shall call you again. No? All right, let him sit down. Hare Krishna, let us begin. Chant Hare Krishna. Do it like that as I have done. Little, little, yes. Three times. Three times. Three times. Yes. Three, two. And now once. Once. Three. Yes. That's all. Eat it. Thank you.